second avirodha adhyaya we looked at the third sutra etena yoga pratyuktah and we saw elaborately as to amsha that agrees with pradhana as jagat karana extending from sankhyas that amsha is refuted by the siddhantin whereas ashtanga yoga which is the तात्पर्य विषय ऑफ योग इज एक्सेप्टेड ओनली एज अ साधना बाय दी वेदांत दैट इज ऑन दी वृत्ति नाउ द पूर्व पक्षी ब्रिंग्स अप टू सूत्रास सो द नेक्स्ट टू सूत्रास आर पूर्व पक्षी सूत्रास ही सेज पूर्व वेद विरुद्ध स्मृते मूलाभावाद अप्रामाण्य मुक्तम He says that Siddhanti, you, the Siddhanti, said that the smritis which are viruddha to the other smritis and to the shruti, because the other smritis are in line with shruti, therefore shruti viruddha or veda viruddha smritis, such as sankhya smritis, have to be set aside. Have to be. reinterpreted otherwise if at all they can be reinterpreted to make samanvaya with shruti tatparya then they have to be reinterpreted or those which have absolutely no connection to shruti they have to be set aside why because they are not pramana so purvam veda viruddha smrte he mula bhava There is no basis for them to talk about pradhana ityadi as jagat karana. Therefore, that foundation is missing. And mula bhava what? Apramanyam. Smrte he apramanyam sankhya smrte he. Uktam it has stated. Tarhi tarkasya vyapti paksha dharma tayo ho mula tve na. Loka siddhatva te na virodha. इति प्रत्युदाहरण संगत्या इधमाह दी पूरो पक्षी नाउ सेज दैट ओके सांख्य स्मृति इज अप्रामान्यम बट तरका न्याय वैशेषिका दर्शनास कैन नॉट बी अप्रामाना व्हाय बिकॉज़ अनुमाना इज प्रामाना देवरफॉर दिस व्याप्ति पक्षधर्मता दीज आर ऑल नीडेड when you analyze something as tatpare vishaya even there you have to use anumana at least one of the lingas in the shad lingas is anumana therefore you cannot say the tarkikas darshanas which are nyaya and vaisheshika are apramanya apramana they have apramana you cannot say therefore you have to accept them as pramana and once you accepted them as pramana then what will happen there will be virodha with your samanvaya of vedanta vakyas into brahma because they say that jagat karana is not brahma jagat karana is parmanu therefore there is virodha with the 
ಲೋಕಸಿದ್ಧ ತರ್ಕಗ್ರಂಥಾಸ್ ದೇರ್ ಇಸ್ ವಿರೋಧ ಸೊ ತರ್ಕಸ್ಯ ವ್ಯಾಪ್ತಿ ಪಕ್ಷ ವ್ಯಾಪ್ತಿ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಪಕ್ಷ ಧರ್ಮತ ವ್ಯಾಪ್ತಿ ಈಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ವೆರ್ ಎವರ್ ದೇರ್ ಈಸ್ ಅನ್ವಯ ವ್ಯತಿರೇಕ ಯು ಕೆನ್ ಸಿ ವ್ಯಾಪ್ತಿ ಸೊ ಎತ್ರ ಎತ್ರ ಧೂಮ ತತ್ರ ತತ್ರ ಅಗ್ನಿ ಈಸ್ ದಿ ವ್ಯಾಪ್ತಿ ಯತ್ರ ಅಗ್ನಿ ಅವ್ರ ವನ್ನಿ ನಾಸ್ತಿ ತತ್ರ ಧೂಮೋ ಅಪಿ ನಾಸ್ತಿ ದಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಎ ವ್ಯಾಪ್ತಿ ಸೊ ದಟ್ ವ್ಯಾಪ್ತಿ ವಿಚ್ ಎಸ್ಟಾಬ್ಲಿಷಸ್ ಬೀಟ್ ಹೇತು ಹೇತು ಮತ್ ಭಾವ ಆರ್ ಕಾರ್ಯಕಾರಣ ಭಾವ ಥ್ರೂ ಅನುಮಾನ ಸಂ ಜ್ಞಾನ ಈಸ್ ಗೇನ್ಡ್ ಅಂಡ್ ದೇರ್ ಫೋರ್ ದಟ್ ವ್ಯಾಪ್ತಿ ಈಸ್ ಪಾರ್ಟ್ ಆಫ್ ದಟ್ ಅನುಮಾನ ವಿಚ್ ಇಸ್ ಪ್ರಮಾಣ ತರ್ಕ ವಿಚ್ ಇಸ್ ಪ್ರಮಾಣ ತರ್ಕಸ್ಯ ವ್ಯಾಪ್ತಿ ಅಂಡ್ ದೆನ್ ಪಕ್ಷಧರ್ಮತ ಪಕ್ಷಧರ್ಮತ ಇಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ದಿ ಪಕ್ಷ ಈಸ್ ವೇರ್ ದೇರ್ ಇಸ್ ಅ ಡೌಟ್ ಇನ್ ದಿ ಸ್ಟಾಕ್ ಎಕ್ಸಾಂಪಲ್ ಆಫ್ ಪರ್ವತೋ ವನ್ನಿಮಾನ್ ನವ ವೆದರ್ ದಿ ಪರ್ವತ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ವನ್ನಿ whether the mountain has fire or not that shanka is there in in the parvata whether the parvata has fire or not therefore parvata is the paksha and the paksha dharmata there you see clearly that there is dhuma in in the case of dhuma there is no doubt as to whether parvata has dhuma whether the mountain has smoke there is no doubt because the smoke is pratyaksha whereas vanni is not pratyaksha so in the amsha of vanni there is a doubt whether the mountain has fire or not therefore mountain the parvata is paksha and the mountains dharma paksha dharmata paksha dharmata is dhuma is paksha dharma it has dhuma and that dhuma which is pratyaksha siddha becomes hetu to not for vanni vanni is the hetu for dhuma but dhuma is hetu for what to to establish uh, the jnana that for the jnana it is hetu for the vanni jnana vanni is hetu for dhuma but dhuma which is pratyaksha pratyaksha jnanena ಜ್ಞಾತಃ ಧೂಮ ಬಿಕಮ್ಸ್ ಹೇತು ಫಾರ್ ವಾಟ್ ಫಾರ್ ವನ್ನಿ ಜ್ಞಾನ ದೇರ್ ವಾಯ್ ದಿಸ್ ಈಸ್ ವೆರಿ ವೆಲ್ ನೋನ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಯೂಸ್ಡ್ ಆಸ್ ಪ್ರಮಾಣ ಇನ್ ದಿ ಲೋಕ ದೇರ್ ಫೋರ್ ಇನ್ ದಟ್ ಕೇಸ್ ಯು ಕೆನಾಟ್ ಸೇ ದಟ್ ತರ್ಕ ಡಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಎನಿ ಮೂಲ ದಟ್ ಫೌಂಡೇಶನ್ ಇಸ್ ಡೆಫಿನೆಟ್ಲಿ ದೇರ್ ವಿಚ್ ಇಸ್ ಲೋಕ ಸಿದ್ಧ ಸೊ ತರ್ಹಿ ತರ್ಕಸ್ಯ ವ್ಯಾಪ್ತಿ ಪಕ್ಷ ಧರ್ಮತೋ ಆಫ್ ವ್ಯಾಪ್ತಿ ಅಂಡ್ ಪಕ್ಷ ಧರ್ಮತ ಮೂಲತ್ವೇನ ದೇ ಡೆಫಿನೆಟ್ಲಿ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಫೌಂಡೇಶನ್ ಮೂಲತ್ವೇನ ಲೋಕಸಿದ್ಧತ್ವ ಸಿನ್ಸ್ ದೇ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಫೌಂಡೇಶನ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಥ್ರೂ ದಟ್ ಫೌಂಡೇಶನ್ ವಿಚ್ ಇಸ್ ಸೀನ್ ದೇರ್ ಇಸ್ ಲೋಕಸಿದ್ಧತ್ವ ಮೂಲತ್ವೇನ ಲೋಕಸಿದ್ಧತ್ವ ತೇನ ವಿರೋಧ ತೇನ ಕಸ್ಯ ವಿರೋಧ ಸಮನ್ವಯ ವಿರೋಧ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮಣಿ ವೇದಾಂತವಾಕ್ಯಾನ ಸಮನ್ವಯ ವಿರೋಧ ಇದು ಪ್ರತ್ಯುದಾಹರಣ ಸಂಗತ್ಯ ಇದಮಾಹ ದೇರ್ ಫೋರ್ ದೇರ್ ಇಸ್ ಕಾಂಟ್ರಡಿಕ್ಷನ್ ವೆನ್ ಯು ಟೇಕ್ ತರ್ಕ ದೆನ್ ತರ್ಕಶಾಸ್ತ್ರ ಈಸ್ ಎಕ್ಸೆಪ್ಟೆಡ್ ಬೈ ಯು ತರ್ಕ ಈಸ್ ಎಕ್ಸೆಪ್ಟೆಡ್ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ತರ್ಕಶಾಸ್ತ್ರ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಟು ಎಕ್ಸೆಪ್ಟೆಡ್ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಟು ಬಿ ಎಕ್ಸೆಪ್ಟೆಡ್ ಆಸ್ ಪ್ರಮಾಣ ಆಸ್ ಸೂನ್ ಆಸ್ ಯು ಸೇ ದಟ್ ದೆನ್ ಪರಮಾಣುಸ್ ವಿಲ್ ಕಮಿಂಗ್ ಟು ಪ್ಲೇ ಆಸ್ ಜಗತ್ ಕಾರಣ ಆಸ್ ಕ್ಲೀನ್ ಬೈ ತರ್ಕಶಾಸ್ತ್ರ ಅಂಡ್ ದೆನ್ ದೇರ್ ಇಸ್ ವಿರೋಧ ವಿತ್ ಯುವರ್ samanvaya in brahma this is the counter example to the earlier sankhya which is not a pramana whereas this counter example tarka is a pramana sankhya smriti is not a pramana but tarka darshana is a pramana therefore there is contradiction and that is the counter example which is used as sangati by the purva pakshi the ಪೂರ್ವಪಕ್ಷಿ ಅಧಿಕರಣ ದಿಸ್ ಅಧಿಕರಣ ಇಸ್ ಪೂರ್ವಪಕ್ಷಿ ಅಧಿಕರಣ ನ ವಿಲಕ್ಷಣತ್ವಾಧಿಕರಣ 
sorry, there is this na has somehow entered here, not na, vilakshanatva adhikaranam. It should be no na here. So, vilakshanatva adhikaranam. This na, na is from what? It is from, uh, that it must have come, come from one of these vrittis, shifted there. Because the OCR is from, you know, the, the book itself has this, uh, uh, the Adhikarana is mentioned in between this. So, it is it is between with a different font size and it is there in uh, in the paragraph. Therefore, this uh, no has come from there in editing something has gone wrong. So, anyway, Puram Veda Virudha Smritihe Mula Bhava Apramanyam Uktam Tarhi Tarkasi Vyapti Paksha Dharmatayo Mula Tvena Loka Siddhatva Tena Virodeti Pratyudarana Sangatya Idamaha Vilakshanatva Adi Adhikaranam Vilakshanatva Adhikaranam The Sutra there is Na Na Vilakshanatva Dasya Tathat Tuncha Shabdat Na Vilakshanatva Dasya Tathat Tuncha Shabdat So Puro Paksha Sutra Puro Pakshi is saying Tarkika That Brahma Jagat Jagataha Upadana Karanam Na Bhavati so, na is Puro Pakshi saying that Brahma cannot be Jagat Karana. That Upadana Karana that you are saying and you think that you have established in the, at the end of the Prathama, Prathama Adhyaya, there Brahma being the Jagat Karana is not acceptable to us. Can't be. Why? Vilakshanatvat. So, Padachida is na Vilakshanatvat. Asya Tathatvam Cha Shabdat. So his Hetu is Vilakshanatvat. Kasya Vilakshanatvat Kena Sa Vilakshanatvam Cha. So this Brahma is Chetana. And what is Jagat? Jagat is Achetana. Now this Jagat which is Achetana cannot be said to be Karya of Chetana Brahma. Therefore, Brahma Jagat Karanam Na. So, this Asya, Asya is what? Asya Chetanasya Jagataha Brahma Jagat Karanam Na. Why? Because Asya Chetanasya, uh, Asya Achetanasya Jagataha Vilakshanatva. Kasmat Vilakshanatva. This Chetanad Vilakshanatum. Chetana Brahmanaha or Chetanad Brahmanaha Asya Jagataha Vilakshanatvat Brahma Jagat Karanam Nabhavati. That is the Viroda Vilakshana. You don't see you don't see any Chetanatva in the Jagat. That Jagat which is a Chetana, how can it have come from? Chetana Brahma. Therefore, the Jagat Karana cannot be Chetana Brahma. It has to be some Achetana Vastu, which is Paramanu. So, Paramanu is Jagat, jagat Karana, Natu Brahma. So, you have shown that Sankhya Pradhana is not Jagat Karana, but Paramanu can be Jagat Karana. Says the Puro Pakshi tar Tarkika. Then he says, and this Vailakshanyam, how do you say Vailakshanyam? If the, if the Siddhanti as Puro Pakshi to the Tarkika, from the Tarkika's perspective, if Siddhanti were to answer or, or question, oh, how is this Vilakshanatvam? How is this Vilakshanatvam? Of Jagat from Brahma, Asya Jagataha Vilakshanatum, Brahmana Vilakshanatum Katham. Kena Pramanena, how do you say that Jagat is Vilakshana from Brahma, meaning how is Jagat a Chetana and Brahma Chetana, therefore there is Vilakshanatum, but how is it that the Jagat is a Chetana or Jada? Siddhanti is not asking that. But Puro Pakshi says that if at all you ask me 
as to how is the vilakshanatvam then i'll give you the answer before and itself tathatvam meaning vilakshanatvancha shabdat so the shabda pramana shruti herself says the upanishad itself says that there is vilakshanatvam where does it say in taitri upanishad vijnanam cha vijnanam cha bhavatu so there vilakshanatvam is mentioned there सच्चा असच्चा भवत असत शब्द इज अचेतन और अविज्ञान सो देर आर मल्टीपल श्रुतिज विच डेफिनेटली से दैट जगत इज अचेतन एंड देर फोर विलक्षणत्व ऑफ जगत विच इज जड़ा फ्रॉम अजड़ा और चेतन ब्रह्म इज एस्टैब्लिश तथा तुम ड्यू टू शब्द ड्यू टू शब्द प्रमाण and this is the hetu vilakshanatvam is the hetu whereby your brahma chetana brahma cannot be jagat karana that is sutra artha atra purvottara pakshayoh samanvaya siddhi tat siddhi riti phala vedah so phala veda here you know in a samasa is explained so purva and uttara paksha purva paksha and uttara paksha have samanvaya siddhi and समन्वय असिद्धि एंड समन्वय सिद्धि तत् सिद्धि समन्वय सिद्धि रिस्पेक्टिवली सो पूर्व पूर्व पक्षी इन पूर्व पक्ष समन्वय सिद्धि एंड उत्तर पक्ष तत् सिद्धि समन्वय सिद्धि वी ऑलरेडी नो दिस बट एनी वे पूर्वोत्तर पक्ष यो इज अ न्यू वर्ड समास देर सो इंस्टेड ऑफ सींग फॉर पूर्व पक्षी देर इज समन्वय असिद्धि एंड फॉर उत्तर पक्ष देर इज तत् सिद्धि समन्वय सिद्धि ही एज यूज समास दैट इज ओनली डिफरेंस आकाशादिक न चेतन प्रकृति आकाशादिक आकाशादिक आकाशादी प्रपंच आकाश आदि यगत तजगत आकाशादिक आकाश इज जड़ा स्टार्टिंग विथ आकाश एव्रीथिंग इज जड़ा एंड दैट इज द एंटायर सेट इज जगत so the jagat is what is achetana and therefore na chetana prakritikam chetana prakritikam is also bahuri chetanam prakritihi yasya jagatah yasya akashadikasya jagatah tad jagat chetana prakritikam na so he says if you claim chetana prakritikam then na nasti so it is not चेतन प्र चेतन इज नॉट प्रकृति प्रकृति इज नॉट उपाधान कारण सो चेतन प्रकृति प्रकृति मीनिंग उपाधान कारण यद्धांति से जगत देन पूर्व पक्षी विल से इट इज नॉट जगत न सो तद जगत इज नॉट चेतन प्रकृति कम एज पर सिद्धांति पूर्व पक्षी से न चेतन प्रकृति कम वाय तार्किका इज गिविंग हेतु तार्किका विल नॉट जस्ट स्टेट यू नो स्टेट सम कंक्लूजन विदाउट एनी हेतु लीडिंग टू इट सो इस द्रव्यवा घटवत सो इस आकाशादिक न चेतन प्रकृति कम कुछ द्रव्यवा घटवत सो घटवत द्रव्यवा सिंस जगत इज वॉट आकाशादी जगत इज ऑल द्रव्य इट्स सब्सटैंशियल इट्स मटीरियल द्रव्य सो इट्स अ मटीरियल एंड एनी मटीरियल वी डोंट सी इट इज हैविंग चेतन एज इट्स प्रकृति एज इट्स उपादान कारण लाइक घटा एग्जाम्पल इज घटवत लाइक घटा घटा इज द्रव्य Your akashadi prapancha is also dravya. Ghata being dravya, what is the material cause for ghata? Material cause. You can say okay, kulala is is sentient. So the pot maker, the potter is sentient, but the potter is not the material cause. The material cause is insentient clay. Therefore, ghata vat achetana prakriti ka. शुड बी दिस द्रव्य आकाशादी द्रव्य प्रपंच जगत इट कैनॉट बी 
చేతన ప్రకృతిక సో చేతన కెనాట్ బి ఇట్స్ మటీరియల్ కాజ్ చేతన క్యాన్ బి ది ఎఫిషియంట్ కాజ్ బట్ మటీరియల్ కాజ్ ఇస్ నాట్ పాసిబుల్ సో నిమిత్త కారణం యూ క్లెయిమ్ వీ మే అగ్రీ బట్ ఇఫ్ యూ క్లెయిమ్ బ్రహ్మ ఈజ్ మటీరియల్ కాజ్ ఉపాదాన కారణ ప్రకృతి వీ వోంట్ ఎగ్రీ ఇది తర్కేణ సమన్వయ విరుద్ధతే న వా ఇది సందేహే సో ఇఫ్ ఐ గివ్ దిస్ యునో గివ్ దిస్ హేతు అండ్ ఎస్టాబ్లిష్ దిస్ థ్రూ అనుమాన ఎస్టాబ్లిష్ దెన్ ఈజ్ దెర్ విరోధ ఆర్ నాట్ యువర్ సమన్వయ ఇన్ బ్రహ్మ ఈజ్ దెర్ విరోధ ఆర్ నాట్ వై బికాస్ యు ఆర్ సమన్వయ ఆఫ్ ఆల్ వాక్యాస్ ఆర్ ఇన్ టు వాట్ బ్రహ్మ విచ్ ఈస్ చేతన యాజ్ జగత్ కారణ దెర్ యాజ్ వీ హ్యావ్ షోన్ యూ దాట్ దేర్ కెనాట్ బి చేతన బ్రహ్మ యాజ్ జగత్ కారణ ఇట్ ఆకాశాది జగత్ ఈజ్ ద్రవ్య లైక్ ఘట దేర్ ఫోర్ ది చేతన బ్రహ్మ కెనాట్ బి ప్రకృతి ఉపాదాన కారణ దేర్ ఫోర్ దేర్ ఈజ్ విరోధ విరోధ సో విరుద్ధతి నవాయితి సందే పూర్వపక్ష న జగత్ చేతన ప్రకృతికం జగత్ ఈజ్ నాట్ చేతన ప్రకృతి డస్ నాట్ హ్యావ్ చేతన యాజ్ ఇట్స్ ఉపాదాన కారణ కుతః విలక్షణత్వ అస్య అచేతనస్య జగతః చేతనాద్ విలక్షణత్వాత్ అస్య షుడ్ ఆల్సో హ్యావ్ బిన్ అండర్లైన్ దేర్ సో అస్య విలక్షణత్వాత్ అస్య అచేతనస్య జగత దిస్ అచేతన జగత్ జగత్ ఈజ్ విలక్షణ డిఫరెంట్ ఫ్రమ్ చేతన వై అచేతన అచేతన దిస్ నన్ ఆల్సో యూ కెన్ సే యాజ్ వాట్ న చేతన అచేతన ఈజ్ ఆల్సో మీనింగ్ ఇట్ ఈస్ నాట్ చేతనస్య అభావ దాట్ ఆల్సో యూ కెన్ టేక్ అండ్ భిన్నత్వాత్ ఆల్సో నంజ్ ఈజ్ భిన్న భిన్నార్థే నంజ్ చేతన భిన్నం అచేతనం దేర్ ఫోర్ దిస్ జగత్ ఈజ్ అచేతన భిన్న ఫ్రామ్ చేతన అండ్ దేర్ ఫోర్ విలక్షణత్వాత్ జగత్ న చేతన ప్రకృతికం చేతన ప్రకృతికం న భవతి అండ్ వాట్ ఈస్ ది వ్యాప్తి దేర్ యత్ విలక్షణం న తత్ తత్ ప్రకృతికం సో యత్ యద్ విలక్షణం యద్ విలక్షణం ఇస్ అ సమాస అండ్ తత్ ప్రకృతికం ఇస్ ఆల్సో సమాస సో యద్ యద్ విలక్షణం యద్ విలక్షణం ఇస్ యస్మాత్ విలక్షణం వాట్ ఎవర్ ఈజ్ డిఫరెంట్ ఫ్రమ్ యత్ సో దిస్ ఫస్ట్ యత్ ఇస్ ది కార్య అండ్ యత్ ఈస్ వాట్ దిస్ సెకండ్ యత్ ఇన్ ది సమాస దాట్ ఈస్ కారణం సో యద్ యద్ విలక్షణం ఇన్ యద్ విలక్షణం న తత్ తత్ ప్రకృతికం తత్ ప్రకృతికం ఈజ్ వాట్ దాట్ ఈస్ ది ప్రకృతి సో దిస్ ఈస్ బహురి సో తత్ ప్రకృతి తత్ ప్రకృతికం మీన్స్ వాట్ ప్రకృతి ఈజ్ ఉపాదాన కారణం సో తత్ ప్రకృతికం ఈజ్ మీన్స్ తత్ తత్ ఆర్ ఈస్ ప్రకృతి బీయింగ్ ఫెమినిన్ యూ కెన్ సే సా ప్రకృతి యస్య సా ప్రకృతి యస్య తత్ తత్ ప్రకృతికం ఆర్ యూ కెన్ సే తత్ ప్రకృతి యస్య ఆల్సో తత్ తత్ ప్రకృతికం దాట్ ఈస్ కాల్డ్ యాజ్ తత్ ప్రకృతిక అండ్ న ఇట్ ఈస్ నాట్ మీనింగ్ వాట్ దిస్ మీన్స్ దట్ విత్ ఎగ్జాంపుల్ ఇట్ విల్ బి వాట్ ఎన్ ఎగ్జాంపుల్ ఈస్ గివెన్ యథా తంతు విలక్షణ ఘట న తంతు ప్రకృతిక ఇది సో తంతు అండ్ ఘట ఆర్ గివెన్ ఇఫ్ యూ సే యద్ యద్ విలక్షణం అండ్ యూ సే ఘట అండ్ మృత్ దెన్ ఇట్ విల్ నాట్ బి యద్ విలక్షణ బికాస్ ఘట ఈస్ ఘట అండ్ మృత్ హ్యావ్ కార్యకారణ భావ సంబంధ సో యూ హ్ టు టేక్ అన్ ఎగ్జాంపుల్ విచ్ విల్ ఫిట్ దిస్ వ్యాప్తి సో యథా తంతు విలక్షణ ఘట తంతో విలక్షణ ఘట ఘట ఈజ్ డిఫరెంట్ ఫ్రమ్ తంతు తంతు ఆర్ ది థ్రెడ్స్ which are karana for what for pata for cloth but not for ghata therefore ghata is what ghata is not one that has tantu as its prakriti upadana karana where threads are not the cause material cause ghata is that for which there is the threads are not the material cause why what is the hetu because ghata is tantu vilakshana pata is not tantu vilakshana but ghata is tantu vilakshana so that that is the example given so therefore 
योर व्याप्ति इज वॉट यद यद विलक्षण न तत्कृतिक यथा तंतु विलक्षण घटा न तंतु प्रकृतिक देर फोर वॉट ही सेंग दैट सिमिलरली युअर जगत इज वॉट यद यद विलक्षण मीन्स वॉट यत यथ हियर इज इन हियर वॉट हेज बीन सेड अस्य जगत चेतन चेतना विलक्षण सो जगत इज विलक्षण जगत जगत इज चेतन विलक्षण देर फोर वॉट इफ यूल पुट इट इन दि व्याप्ति न तत् तत्प्रकृति सो जगत इज नॉट तत्प्रकृति मीनिंग चेतन प्रकृति सो तत् दि यथ एंड तत् शुड पॉइंट टू दि सेम थिंग दि फस्ट यथ एंड दि दिस फस्ट यथ एंड दिस तत् इज इन सामनाधिकरण एंड सामसगत यथ एंड सामसगत सेकेंड सामसगत तत् इज ऑलसो इन सामनाधिकरण सो यथ जगत यद विलक्षण चेतन विलक्षण चेतन विलक्षण यद जगत यद विलक्षण चेतन विलक्षण न तत् जगत तत्कृतिक चेतन प्रकृतिक सो दैट जगत विच इज डिफरेंट फ्रॉम चेतन यद विलक्षण डिफरेंट फ्रॉम विच एवर वॉट इज दट विच विच एवर चेतन दैट जगत न तत् दैट जगत इज नॉट तत्कृतिक मीन जगत चेतन प्रकृतिक चेतन इज नॉट दि प्रकृति फॉर दैट जगत चेतन इज नॉट दि प्रकृति नॉट उपादान कारण फॉर दैट जगत ननु ब्रह्म जगत हो वैलक्षण्यम कुतः हाउ डू यू से दैट दिस ब्रह्म इज नॉट जगत कारण बिकॉज जगत इज डिफरेंट फ्रॉम ब्रह्म सो ब्रह्म जगत बिटवीन ब्रह्म एंड जगत हाउ इज देर वैलक्षण्यम How is there a difference between Brahma and Jagat? If at all, the Siddhanti, where to ask? This is a hypothesis. If at all, Siddhanti, where to object and ask a question? No, you first you establish. You cannot use it as a hetu. See, vilakshanatva hetu can be used to establish some sadhya only when that hetu is acceptable to both parties. Your hetu should be sad hetu. How is it a sad hetu? What is the pramana for that hetu? If that kind of a question comes up, then the tarkika says, "I am very thorough in my tarka, so I'll tell you this vilakshanatva hetu is is sad hetu. Why? So Brahma lakshana ho, Vai lakshanyam. Uh, sorry, Brahma jagato ho, Vai lakshanyam. Kutaha. Tathatvam je shabda. There is a pramana for Vai lakshanyatvam. Tathatvam Vai lakshanyatvam." शब्दात भवती शब्दात श्रुति प्रमाणात भवती वेद प्रमाणात शब्द प्रमाणात तथा तुम इज वॉट वैलक्षण्यम हाउ इज हाउ इज इट एस्टाब्लिश विज्ञान चा विज्ञान चा भवत इत्यादि श्रुति अवगत ही सेज दिस दिस चेतन विज्ञान इज चेतन एंड अविज्ञान मीन्स वॉट इज अचेतन सो If at all you say that the prapancha is has chetana as well as achetana, my focus is not on vidyana which is chetana, but my focus is on avidyana which is jada achetana. So that pramana is there. Shruti is saying that in Taitiriya Shruti is saying that vidyana in cha vidyana in cha bhavat. Actually, this statement itself goes against the Tarkika. He is quoting this Shruti. But has not seen the tatparya there. Otherwise, we also can quote this very shruti and say that cha abhavat kaha kaha abhavat or kim abhavat. What is it that has become that became vidyana and avidyana, meaning sentient and insentient beings? What is it that became? You look at that. Who is the karta of the sentence for abhavat? For abhavat kriya pada. Who is the karta? If we ask, then he all his tarka will fall apart. Why? Because shabda pramana will supersede all his tarka. Shabda pramana itself is there. Brahma has become chetana. Brahma itself has become sentient and insentient beings. So abhavat karta is Brahma. But anyway, his focus is not on shabda pramana. He is quoting shabda pramana for his hetu, and with hetu he is proving that. For through tarka, he is proving that 
your achetana jagat cannot be the product of chetana brahma so his focus is very limited he will say i have given you shabda pramana for my hetu and now since my hetu is sad hetu vyakti is established and therefore this sadhya is also established as to what jagat cannot be chetana prakriti ka ityadi shruti tha avagatam ityartha so he has given you the tarka whereby there is samanvaya asiddhi then if the siddhanti were to further say know the entire prapancha although it is vijnanam cha vijnanam cha what is the nature of the prapancha puro pakshi says that it is jada therefore it cannot be karya of ajada brahma chetana brahma now if at all puro pakshi were to say why do you say that vijnanam and avijnana being there he is expecting he is expecting a retort he says that because vidyana and avidyana both are there in the jagat meaning sentient and insentient i am saying that the prapancha is avidyana achetana jada if you were to say no the prapancha is chetana vidyana some total see basically what uh, in uh, if in vyakarana let's say in vyakarana you say that बालक बालका च बालिका च गच्छन्ति इट्स बहुवचन सो बॉयज एंड गर्ल्स आर गोइंग टू से विद्यालय गच्छन्ति दे आर गोइंग टू स्कूल अनदर वे टू से इट इज दैट देर इज अंतर्भाव ऑफ स्त्रीलिंग इन पुल्लिंग जस्ट लाइक इन इंग्लिश यू से ही ही इज कॉमनली यूज इट इज नॉट दैट एनीबडी इज अपोज टू अदर जेंडर feminine gender it is just that this the word she is included in he this is how the language is whether it is due to patriarchal society whatever you say all that arop is fine but the language is like that the modern effort is to change the language all that is there but then at least in our school days this was the grammar now in sanskrit also when you say balakaha gachanti the children are going is a good translation unless you specifically know that it is only a boy school and then you say balakaha gachanti it is a you know ved patha is going on and then you say that uh, uh, what uh, ved uh, ved patshala am gach uh, part uh, ved patshala am gachanti if that is a concern then you say okay boys are there but otherwise if it is school general school coed then you say what बालका गच्छन्ति मीन्स बालिकाज आर ऑल्सो इन्क्लूडेड नीड नॉट नेसेसरली मीन ओनली बॉयज आर गोइंग बॉयज एंड गर्ल्स आर गोइंग इज अ गुड ट्रांसलेशन और चिल्ड्रन आर गोइंग सिमिलरली हियर नाउ विज्ञान चा विज्ञान चा भवत दि जगत हेज चेतना हेज अचेतना सो यू कैन से वन इज इन्क्लूडेड इन दि अदर एंड मेक अ सिंगल स्टेटमेंट ऑल्सो यू नो जस्ट टॉक अबाउट जगत एज वॉट ओ जगत इज सेंशियल बिकॉज देर इज यूज इज लाइक दैट वेन यू से वो लुक एट दि द वर्ल्ड इज लाइक दैट when when you some someone says that why oh, got cheated the world is like that so you don't mean the world insentient world is like that you mean the sentient world is like that therefore when you say the world is like that a loke tatha eva bhavati somebody got cheated you say oh these days kaliyuga kaliyuga khalu so you say tatha eva bhavati loke so there loka is prapancha where insentient is not included there you are talking about sentient similarly when you say oh the you know the due to uh, due to what say global warming or something the the world is you know the 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 world is not going to be there any more something like that you know the the nature is is changing so you mean nature there which is insentient you say the world is changing the world is changing due to global warming there you mean that the insentient world is changing so the world or loka shabda is also what contextually as a whole sentient or insentient now if that is the perspective that puro pakshi has taken the siddhanti may also say why are you taking the world to be insentient jagat need not be insentient it can be sentient also then puro pakshi will the tarkika will ask a pramana what is your pramana that jagat is 
sentient so thereby the purva pakshi tarkika expects an answer or pramana quoted by the siddhanti so hypothesis nanu te ima ime pranaha aham shreyase vivadamanah ityadika bhi shruti bhi brahmavad jagat chetanam iva avagamyate tyashankya so if at all the siddhanti siddhanti is going to answer the question as this loka shabda jagat shabda does not mean it is insentient loka jagat is prapancha is sentient and for that sentient or at least it appears as sentient that much at least you have to accept because there is a shruti pramana siddhanti is not saying that if at all siddhanti were to argue because purva pakshi has in tarka he is taking the objections and resolving those initial itself he says if at all you were to say then i you have to show me a pramana and if at all you show me a pramana also like what te me pranah aham shreyase vivadamanah there is a vivada going on shruti says that this is shruti there is a vivada going on between whom prana prana is what insentient prana is insentient and indriyas are insentient but in that section the indriyas and prana are fighting amongst each other there is a vivada going on as to what aham shreyase with respect to this one being superior to the other each indriya is claiming that i am superior to you all of you prana is also claiming i am superior to all of you so te me prana ha all these pranas also aham shreyase vivadamana ha they are having vivada and vivada is not possible between indriyas unless the indriyas which are part of jagat pranas which are part of jagat so that prana roopa jagat or indriya roopa jagat cannot be insentient why because vivada is there vivada is not possible between insentient it is possible only among sentient beings therefore achetana jagat cannot be jagat has to be chetana if you use this pramana says the tarkika ityadi ka bhi shruti bhi using these shrutis such kind of shrutis if you say that jagat is what chetana chetanam iva shruti bhi brahmavat jagat chetanam iva jagat is brahmavat chetana it is chetana just like brahma or it is chetana it is iva avagamyate it is known as so you can say brahmavat jagat chetanam iva avagamyate means what it appears like brahma it also appears to be sentient prapancha why because pranas are sentient is the shruti vakya if prana is sentient prana is part of jagat and therefore jagat is sentient prana makes the makes everything move such statements are also there therefore prana is sentient therefore prapancha is chetana brahma is chetana chetana prapancha chetana jagat can can definitely be karya of chetana brahma and thereby there is no vilakshanatva vilakshanatva hetu is asad hetu therefore your yad yad vilakshanam na tat tat prakritikam vyapti falls apart and therefore your sutra which has gone by is invalidated if at all the statement has he has come up as an objection from siddhanti vedanti then the puro pakshi says i'll give you another reason as to another sutra iti ashankya this is also a puro pakshi sutra tarkika sutra abhimani vyapadeshastu visheshanugatibhyam abhimani vyapadeshastu visheshanugatibhyam so he says this abhimani vyapadeshah tu visheshanugatibhyam three padas are there so abhimani vyapadeshah the teaching or the statement of the shruti which you have quoted and such statements or similar statements in the shruti which talk about abhimana abhimana being there in these indriyas prana ityadi that is only what vishesh anugati bhyam it is this is basically what this abhimani 
prana is abhimani that i am superior that kind of abhimana or abhimana is what that association with prana is of a sentient being it is of a sentient being because that abhimani devata is meant prana is not prana itself meaning prana as the pancha prana ityadi but prana is referring to the prana devata who is prana abhimani devata so abhimani vyapadesha there is a prana abhimani vyapadesha not not the prana as the pancha prana or indriya being indriya itself but one who is associated with the indriya is the devata that devata is sentient so when the vivaha is taking place between indriyas and prana among them it is not between indriyas it is between the abhimani devata the presiding deities of those indriyas and prana are having vivaha therefore when you say that prana is sentient it is not that the prana pancha prana is sentient but the prana abhimani devata is sentient says the tarkika so abhimani vyapadeshas tu abhimani vyapade tu shabda is to uh, to refute that it is this prana means prana itself prana vayu itself it means it does not mean prana vayu or indriyas as indriyas but this tu shabda is refuting the claim that the prana and indriyas are in swartha but what is the reality abhimani vyapadesha is there meaning prana abhimani indriya abhimani devata vyapadesha is there how do you know that vishesha anugati bhyam there is a vishesha vishesha is visheshana and anugati anugati is anugamana you see this by uh the anugati and visheshana the visheshana is used it will be clear in the vritti further ukta shamka nirasartha stu shabda this two shabda is to refute the stated doubt as to what this prana is prana and indriyas are having a dialogue or a debate claim that they are superior compared to each other each of these indriyas and pranas are claiming superiority each is claiming superiority therefore prapancha which is made up of these indriyas and prana they are all what they are they being sentient the jagat is also sentient this was the claim made if such claim is made then that that is refuted now ukta shanka nirasartha tu shabda ukta shruti bhi na jagat chetanatvam pratyetavyam one should not think that because this shruti has been quoted therefore prana and indriyas are sentient and therefore jagat is sentient sentient what should one know that those prana and indriya shabdas are not in swartha they are in abhimani prana abhimani and indriya abhimani devatas yataha prana abhimani nam yatha yataha this is yatha yasmat karana प्राणाद्यभिमानिनी नाम देवता नाम तत्र व्यपदेशो भवति द टीचिंग इज ऑफ द प्राणादि देवतास नॉट प्राणादि वायु और इंद्रियादि इटसेल्फ बट इंद्रियादि अभिमानी देवतास न प्राणादि मात्रस्य प्राणादि मात्र इंद्रिय मात्र इज नॉट बीइंग टॉक्ड अबाउट देयर बट व्हाट इज बीइंग टॉक्ड अबाउट इज द अभिमानी देवतास कुतः हाउ डू यू नो सो विशेष अनुगतिभ्याम विशेष इज विशेषण सो विशेषण विशेष विशेषण इज अर्थ फॉर विशेष शब्द विच इज इन दि सूत्र इन दि सामस सो विशेषण इज नॉट दर इन सूत्र विशेषण इज दि मीनिंग इज गिवन अर्लियर टू विशेष सो विशेष इज इक्वल टू विशेषण एंड अनुगति इज दि सैकेंड वर्ड इन दि सामस सो विशेषण विशेष अनुगति ताभ्याम ड्यू टू सो ताभ्याम हेतुभ्याम दिस पंचमी divachana as hetu due to the visheshana and anugati you know that it is abhimani devata not the prana pranadi matra so etahavai devata aham shriyase 
विवदमान प्राणा चेतनवाचिना देवता शब्द विशेषित सो वॉट यू आर कोटिंग इज दैट ते मे प्राण अहम श्रेयसे विवदम इफ यू लुकैट लुकैट दि कॉन्टेक्स देर दि वाक्य शेष विल सी एता हई देवता इज देर एता हई देवता सो देवता आर बीइंग टॉक्ड अबाउट एज हैविंग अ डिस्कशन और डिबेट क्लेमिंग दैट दे आर सुपीरियर ईच वन इज सुपीरियर टू ईच अदर सो अहम श्रेयसे विवदम दे आर नॉट इट इज नॉट दैट दि प्राणादि मात्र बट प्राणादि अभिमानी देवता प्राण देव प्राण अभिमानी देवता दि दे आर हैविंग अ डिस्कशन इति प्राणानाम चेतनवाचिना देवता शब्देन दिस देवता शब्द इज इज चेतनवाची योर प्राण इज नॉट चेतनवाची बट प्राण देवता इज चेतनवाची देयरफॉर प्राण इज प्राण देवता देयर प्राण अभिमानी देवता सो प्राणानाम चेतनवाचिना देवता शब्देन विशेषित विशेषण देर इज अ क्वालिफिकेशन द वर्ड इज क्वालिफाइड बाय देवता इट इज नॉट प्राण एज अ वर्ड यू नॉट जस्ट डैंग्लिंग देर इट इज इट इज टू बी सीन विद द विशेषण विच हेज गॉन बाय एंड देयर बाय दैट विशेषण विल शो दि अभिमानी देवता नॉट दि प्राण मात्र अग्निर्वाग्भूवा मुखम प्राविशत इत्यादि मंत्रार्थवादादिषु सर्वत्र तदभिमानी देवता अनुगति श्रवणाच न चेतन जगत एंड देन देर इज ऑलसो अनुगति देर इज देर इज अनुगति यू नो फ्रॉम दि अदर श्रुतिज ऑलसो वॉट इज दट अदर श्रुति अग्निर्वाक भूतवा मुखम प्राविशत सो दिस अनुगति अनुगति दिस इंद्रिय और प्राण दे आर अभिमानी देवता हाउ डू यू नो because there is anugati there is pravesha also there is identification of these devatas with the indriyas as what presiding deities not identification really but they they are presiding over those indriyas you can say identification also with samashti and in vyasti individually also you can see that but then generally we say that they are adhi, uh, adhishthatra devatas at the samashti level they are themselves called by those names but then at individual level they are the ones who preside over these indriyas therefore we say what you know uh, uh, chakshoho surya aditya so when a chakshur indriya is not functioning well uh, people say that okay you do aditya you know aditya upasana or you know uh, some stotras relate to aditya surya so surya devata will give you good eyesight why because he is the presiding deity of the chakshur indriya similarly what this agni devata has entered the vagendriya so that is the anugati so agnir vag bhutva shows that the agni devata himself has become vak in each and every living being so he is the adhishthatra devata for vagendriya for the organ of speech therefore therefore you say you know the, It was a very fiery speech. Somebody says something, there is anger there. You see, or you know, if you can hear that with uh, that kind of that oratory is such that it is, you know, there is fire <laughs> when he speaks. There is fire, so that agni rvag bhutva mukham pravishat entered the agni de agni devata entered the mukha by becoming what vagendriya, not as food as vagendriya. इत्यादि मंत्रार्थवादादिषु सो दिस अर्थवाद मंत्र सम प्रेज इज देयर इज वन वे टू लुक एट कर्मकांडी सेज दैट देयर इज अर्थवाद वाक्य अर्थवाद अगेन वी हैव भूतार्थवाद इज आल्सो पॉसिबल सिंस वी हैव नो प्रमाण टू नो दिस अग्नि देवता एट ऑल वी कैन सी अग्नि बट अग्नि देवता वी कैन नॉट सी देयरफॉर नो प्रमाण अदर देन श्रुति tells us of this agni devata so arthavada is bhutarthavada also possible need not be necessarily just a praise or a glorification which is not true that is not the case so ityadi mantrarthavada adishu it can be mantra it can be arthavada all these show what they show that these devatas have associated with indriyas and prana as presiding deities सर्वत्र तदभिमानी देवता अनुगति श्रवणाच न चेतनम जगत
therefore chetana is not the characteristic of jagat jagat is not sentient at all it is the devata who is associated with parts of the jagat parts of the sharira with sadatmya sambandha or with uh, adishthatritvam whatever is the sambandha but it is the devata who is sentient not the vishaya which is jagat that is not chetana tasmad achetanasya jagata vailakshanyat na chetana prakritikam na chetana prakritikatvam therefore chetana cannot be the prakriti or upadana karana brahma which is chetana cannot be the upadana karana for jagat which is achetana jada and that vailakshanya hetu is not asad hetu it is sad hetu therefore my vyapti as to yad yad vilakshanam na tat that prakritikam is established and therefore your brahma being jagat karana is not possible samanvaya siddhi is there evam purva pakshe siddhanta evam purva pakshe prapte siddhanta when this is the purva paksha as to jagat cannot have insentient jagat cannot have sentient brahma as its karana दृश्यते तु दृश्यते तु सेज दी सिद्धांति सो दिस अ सिद्धांति सूत्र एज अ आंसर टू द अर्लियर टू पूर्व पक्ष सूत्र दृश्यते तु व्हाट दृश्यते तु ही सेज दैट इन द प्रपंच इटसेल्फ यू सी दैट ऑल्दो द कार्य इज अचेतना कारण कैन बी चेतना and you should not bring science and all that you should not bring you know the modern science to uh, refute this this is a paksha also of an era you should understand the era also whatever is the pramana available then based on that the sutras have been created so you should always see it in that light and you should also see all of this as what the uh, the whatever is talked about some adrishta is there there also that cannot be replaced by modern Uh, you know modern claims of science so we should not uh, really discount all this because of science saying something different because what appears to be that is pramana nobody then has put any of it under the mic- microscope and seen it is under the tarka microscope it is under the shruti microscope it is not under the science microscope so you should not say that Uh, a chetana coming from chetana being born from chetana is not valid so we'll uh, see such kind of examples so uh, let not your uh, i'm saying it beforehand because let not your buddhi run into such kind of an argument because it happens you know how can it be uh, you know we, we are better informed now therefore you should change all these arguments all that is not necessary you get the idea move on that's it सो एवं पूर्वपक्षे सिद्धांत दृश्यते तो व्हाट इज सीन दृश्यते इट इज सीन दैट चेतना कैन बी द कॉज फॉर अचेतना सो पूर्वपक्ष निराशार्थ तु शब्द विल सी व्हाट इज सीन इन दी वृत्ति दिस तु शब्द इज टू रिफ्यूट दी पूर्वपक्षी बट इट इज सीन बट इट इज सीन मीन्स व्हाट the chetana is seen as a karana for a chetana or a chetana is seen to be born from chetana drishyate tu yad uktam chetana vilakshanam jagat na tat prakritikam iti tanna so yad uktam what has been stated by the purva pakshi in tarkika in his sutra as to chetana vilakshanam jagat na tat prakritikam we do not agree that चेतन विलक्षण जगत कैनॉट बी हैविंग मीनिंग चेतन विलक्षण मीनिंग अचेतन जड़ा जड़ा जगत कैनॉट बी हैविंग चेतन ब्रह्म एज इट्स प्रकृति उपादान कारण वी डू नॉट एग्री तन्न वी डू एग्री दट चेतन विलक्षण जगत वी एग्री मीनिंग जगत इज जड़ा वी एग्री बट जड़ा जगत कैनॉट कम फ्रॉम चेतन ब्रह्म as its prakriti as its upadana karana that we do not agree tanna why chetanat purushat tad vilakshananam nakhalomadinam achetananam achetanaccha gomaya gomayat chetana vrushchikadinam 
उत्पत्तिर यथा हा दृश्यते अतः इत्यर्थ हा दृश्यते I have not marked these yet so दृश्यते should be underlined and two शब्द also which is the सूत्रा so अचेतनात and चेतनात चेतनात अचेतन उत्पत्ति and अचेतनात चेतन उत्पत्ति both are same says the so we will give you examples not only for one way that you are claiming the other way also we will say meaning all of this is possible you cannot deny the possibility you cannot just claim that it is not possible as to chetana chetana being born from chetana is the only focus of the tarkika but then we give an answer saying that not only chetana can be born from chetana chetana can also be born from chetana and therefore this uh, vyapti that you have is not right that vyapti as to yad yad vilakshanam na tat tat prakritikam that vyapti is invalidated if we give you a single example also it is invalidated and we will give you both types of example so chetana at purusha the purusha is chetana or not definitely chetana from a person tad vilakshana meaning chetana vilakshana chetana vilakshana nam nakha lomaadi nam nakha the nails lomaadi are the hair the the body hair so the nails and hair which are insentient otherwise you cannot cut your nails you cannot cut your hair so they are definitely insentient are they born from purusha or not so they are achetana but they are born from achetana so they are born from chetana chetana purusha so purusha is chetana from that chetana purusha achetana vilakshana meaning achetana nakhaloma are born and other way around also we have seen achetana cha gomayat gomaya is the cow dung so you don't have to put it under a microscope and see from what you know what kind of eggs it is born or whatever but just looking from your pratyaksha pramana indriyas when you don't have all these tools available if you look at a child who is learning who looks at this he sees that cow dung was there and then that is achetana cow dung is achetana gomaya chetana vrishchikadina utpatti hi he sees scorpion coming out or one of these you know insects coming out from the dung what they are born from are not pratyaksha what is pratyaksha the cow dung is pratyaksha therefore it is the upadana karana it is the origin from the, for all of it to be born so even if see there is an egg some you know all that is not seen what is seen is that from the achetana gomaya there is utpatti of vrishchika ityadi so other way round is also possible such because see tark tarkika is using tarka and this will be this kind of an argument will suit him he'll say okay i agree he, because otherwise he also has to use some tarka to refute this also so if you have given him an example which is pratyaksha siddha then that will definitely counter his tarka so this is the process used being what the brahma sutra being a nyaya prasthana this tarka has to be there and this tarka cannot be you know bringing in uh, the modern tools and all that so here we are just saying that at least you know for first part one has to agree second part is not really applicable here it is not needed but it is also given as to there is no such niyama that from chetana achetana cannot be born from or from achetana chetana can be born there is no such niyama you cannot bring a random rule or you cannot bring a random statement and claim it to be a rule that is the siddhanti but what is a param siddhanta really all of this is possible anything and everything is possible finally we will say anything and everything is possible because all of this is mithya swapnavat so mayaya sarvasya sambhavat is what the param siddhanta is going to be but while arguing with the purva pakshi who has no business with maya or anything there we don't bring in these because tarka or the debate also should be between two pakshas who agree with some foundation that is the basis for the discussion so for astika darshanas all these astika darshanas siddhanti uses shruti as pramana and finally he'll show shruti where tarka is needed with tarkikas he'll show tarka also but with uh, bauddhas and jainas 
which will also come up later much later in the in the uh, brahma sutra their shruti is not a pramana for bauddhas and jainas therefore their shruti cannot be quoted shruti is quoted in those sections also but it is quoted for the vedanti astika followers as to you stay with this but when we want to refute the bauddhas we'll refute bauddhas and jainas nastika pakshas purva pakshas in two fold manner primarily for them we'll use only tarka tarka and we'll use all other pramanas except for shabda pramana then when we use shabda pramana that is additionally for the siddhantis or the astika followers it is not to refute the nastikas bauddhas and jainas it is not in the discussion with them but it, it is for the students who are trying to study who are astikas who have nothing to do with uh, following bauddha pramana this we we have students who are also following this therefore when the um, when the astika darshanas or astika uh, astika darshanas are refuted then shruti is quoted but when nastika darshanas are refuted there when the shruti is quoted that shruti is not to refute the bauddha and the jaina or the nastika darshanas for the nastikas but it is only for the astikas who are also there primary discussion is primarily the discussion is with tarka only because that alone will take away the objections made or the claims made by the nastika bauddha and jaina in this context here shruti as well as tarka is used here tarka is being used because whatever the tar- tarkika has quoted there the loka prasiddha nyaya will work pra- pratyaksha pramana will also work whatever the tarkika considers as pramana those should be used to refute meaning their own tools should be used to refute them drishyate atah ityartha therefore what yatah drishyate atah yatah tadrishi utpatti hi drishyate atah atah what atah samanvaya finally we will say samanvaya siddhi na bhavati samanvaya siddhi eva bhavati na avirodha basically what virodha na bhavati prakriti vikarayoho atyanta sadrshe prakriti vikara bhava anubhapatya yatkinchit sadrshyam vachyam tatcha prakrite api jagati spuranadya anuvrtya samanam iti bhavah so how is it close now so prakriti vikaryo prakriti is upadana karana vikar karana and vikara is what karya so between the karana and karya if there is atyanta sadrushyam if they are extremely similar meaning what they are same if they are extremely similar they will be same then there will be no karya karana bhava prakriti vikara bhava anubhapatti bhavati if you say that prakriti is chetana and vikara is cannot be a chetana if you the tarkika purva pakshi says that prakriti being chetana brahma vikara cannot be karya cannot be a chetana jagat why because atyanta abheda is there we'll say atyanta abheda is not there then so atyanta sadrishyam says the purva pakshi we say atyanta sadrishya is also not there why if atyanta sadrishya is there if they are extremely similar they'll be same that extreme similarity will make same it make it same there will be no similarity there there will be sameness so prakriti vikara bhava anubhapatti bhavati if they are all of it is similar then it is same there will be no karya karana bhava at all there will be no difference between jagat and brahma at all between murt and ghata at all but there is there is difference although all pots clay pots are clay clay is not pot so that kind of a dissimilarity will be there although all karyas are karana kar material cause upadana karana upadana karana is not karya 
it is more than karya more than one karya more than 10 karyas more than 100 karyas it will always be more that's why the karana will always be more than the sum total of all karyas also so prakriti vikara bhav anupapatti will be there it will be untenable to have karya karana bhava and prakriti vikara bhav anupapatya yatkinchit sadrushyam vachyam Puro Pakshi says, okay, you tell me what is the sadrusha between Jagat and Prapancha, uh, prapancha Jagat, which is insentient. Jada Prapancha Jagat and Chetana Brahma, what is the sadrusha? Some sadrusha you have to tell me, otherwise Kare Karana Bhava will not be possible. If you say Atyanta Sadrusha Prakriti Vikara Bhava Anupapattir Bhavati, then I will say, says the Tarkika, Prakriti Vikara Yoho Atyanta Bhede. Atyanta bhede prakriti vikara bhava anupapattir bhavati. Even if there is atyanta bheda also, there will be no prakriti vikriti bhava. There will, no be, there will not be karya karana bhava. So, not only due to atyanta sadrisham, there is no karya karana bhava, but also due to atyanta bheda also, there will be no karya karana bhava. So, you have to tell me some sadrisham at least. Kinjit sadrisham vaktavyam. You have to tell me. What is the similarity between Prapancha Jada Jagat and Chetana Brahma? Tell me some sadrusha. So Siddhanti says, Tacha Prakriti Api Jagati Spurana Dhyanurtya. There is Purana Ityadi. Spurana, you see Jagat. In Jagat also there is Purana. What is this Purana? Chaitanya Vada Avabhasati. Chetana Vada Avabhasati. That Purana is there. Sadvada Avabhasati is also Spurana there. So Sadvada Avabhasati, Chetana Vada Avabhasati, Ananda Vada Avabhasati, all these are there as Sadrushya. There is similarity in Prapancha because you see Spurana there. Jagat Bhati, that itself is Purana. Jagat Bhati Vadova, is the Prapancha cognized by you or not? Ask the Siddhanti to the Puro Pakshi. And that cognition is what? Jnana Rupa. So that Jnana that you have of Ghatapatadi Jnana, you the Tarkika Puro Pakshi who makes all these claims based on Pratyaksha, that Pratyaksha is Jnana. So what Jnana you get in Prapancha is all Brahma. Therefore the Jnana in Jagat and Jnana of Brahma, Brahma is defined that in the same Taitri Upanishad, Brahma is defined as what? Satyam Jnanam Anantam Brahma. That Satyam Jnanam, all that you see, Jagadasti, that is Sadrusha. Jagad Bhati, that is Sadrusha. Therefore, Tacha Prakriti, Prakriti api, in this context also, of the Kare Karana Bhava between Brahma and Jagat, you see such Sadrusha also. Jagati is Puranadi Anurutya. Adi Padana, you can bring Sat. Purana is Jnana. Adipadena Sat Ityadi, whatever you see in the Prapancha, Satyatvam, Bhana Ityadi, all of these are similar to the Brahma Satta and Brahma Jnana, Chaitanya. Not Brahma Jnana as Jnana, Brahma Swarupa as Chaitanya. So Chaitanatva, Bhana that you have in any Vishaya in the Jagat is same as the Chaitanya of the Brahma. Therefore, Sadrishama Sisamanamiti Bhavaha. This is the Nirakarana of the Tarkika who says that there is Samanvaya Siddhi. Then, next we will see Asatkarya Vadam Ashankya Nirachaste. Then, Asatkarya Vada we will look at and there will be Nirakarana of that also in the next part. Amnayantik Samsiddham Adi Madhyanda Varjanam. आनंद गणम आपूर्ण आत्म ज्योति रूपासु ओम तत्सत नमस्ते नमस्ते अनुवाद